This is called a seedling square. It's got the little funnel that comes with it and you put just a little bit of dirt in there. That's dirt, right? Or is that the seeds? That's the, okay, that's this. First you poke the hole. First you poke the hole. How do you poke the hole? Ah, you poke a hole with this thing. Depending on what you're planning will be how deep you you poke the hole. Okay. And you learn that from the seed packet? How deep to do it? Yes. And from the square. The square has instructions? Yes. So what are the red things going to be? Carrots. Carrots. And then, so the yellow things can be a different seed? Or you will have to look on the packet. Each color represents different crops. So can you put seeds in all of these holes at once? Or no. just pick one color? You just pick one color. Based on the crops. But that really maximizes your space. Yes. How much did the seed seeding, how much did the seeding square cost? $20. $20, and you can keep reusing it oh, over absolutely. and over and over it's again. Oh, absolutely, it's hard plastic. You can even share it with your neighbors and they can do it and give it right back to you, right? Yes. How do you know how many seeds? I noticed you didn't put just one seed in there. Yes, I am putting just one seed. Oh, you are putting just one seed. Yes. And the great thing about this square is it separates them the distance they are supposed to be so that they can grow healthy. Whereas and over here with your radishes that you did, you just made your best guess, right? Yes. Or you can measure it out this way, but instead of doing it in rows, which the radishes are done, you do it in a square so it takes up more space plant-wise, coverage-wise, so it requires less watering, less weeding. They act to choke themselves, choke the weeds out themselves. Oh, beautiful.